Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. Today I want to give you guys the follow-up to the Zero Three Arena run after Im immediately after doing the worst you can do in Arena. I bounced back and I bounced back incredibly hard going, uh, well, it's a bit of a spoiler obviously, but you know already, went 12-0 in a Rogue Arena run. And I've been doing particularly well with Rogue lately. Almost every single run is north of 10 wins this month for me. And a lot of people are pretty curious. I was... As, as I was playing, people were mentioning in chat, it's like only Crip can do well with these garbage rogue decks. Now, I wouldn't call this deck garbage, but it's certainly unremarkable. I think it was a 68-point deck, uh, low on the two drops, kind of how I like to play rogue, and uh, reasonably high on the three and four, again, kind of how I like to play rogue. But what I want to focus on in this run is uh, the gameplay. So the decisions that I make, trying to manage my health pool, trying to save my removal options for things that I know are on their way against me. You know, right now, so many people have answers. So many people have large taunt minions. So you got to save those hard removal options for when you need them. And when you're playing rogue and you have, you know, weapons that deals with a lot of these issues, you have to save those as well while conserving and essentially saving the health that you would use to attack into these larger minions. And uh, overall, I think if you take it carefully, Rogue can go really far right now. Rogue statistically is not one of the best classes right now. It's somewhere in the middle, but I guarantee you it's just because of experience and gameplay style. Rogue is in fact one of, if not the best class when played correctly. And in today's Today's video, uh, maybe we'll start something, maybe you guys can tell me if you want to see more of videos like these, but I'm going to include every single game of this run. So it is a full, complete run. Sorry, Anya, she's going to have to edit all of it, but uh, she'll, she'll, she'll do okay. She'll probably have to stream it tonight anyway. So if you like videos like these, let me know. If you don't like, honestly, let me know too. Um, and if, if the reaction is pretty good from you guys. Uh, we can continue these and uh, we can call them as we call this one the Hearthstone Masterclass. Hope you enjoy it and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Shaman's not that good. Like, I'll go ahead and play Rogue. Get like one decent backstab on their minions and they, they don't win the whole game so all their deck is trash. Right? Shaman's the sixth best class. It's really good when you get lucky, and when your opponent gets a bad hand, and when your opponent gets unlucky. Which somehow happened non-stop. But in general, it's really not that good. Fine. Fine. Rogue doesn't even need two drops. Hero power is good enough. Warlock's number one right now. Yeah, you guys label me for being salty and stuff, but honestly, if you guys experience that, you might even uninstall the game on the spot. I literally experienced a zero decision-making 40 minutes of Hearthstone where I couldn't do anything but lose brutally. What is there to say about it? Top bucket, boys. Fine. Let me do it because everyone's bad when you lose, but you're the best when you win. Stop being super egotistical. I didn't call those guys bad. What? This is, again, just more like dumb rhetoric that gets repeated constantly. 
This guy just got lucky as fuck. There was no decision making. The whole thing was autoplay. Coin totem. Yeah, to be fair, I should have made more fun of those guys than I did. Those guys really didn't play very well, but I didn't make that the highlight. The highlight was just crap RNG the whole time. He didn't have a buff in hand. He top decked the buff two turns later. Fine. Screw that, I'm taking MC Tech, boys. Card of champions on almost every single arena deck. 68.8, but that's pretty good for Rogue. Rogue doesn't see too high scores. Oh look, Mage. At least I'm going first. Mage is one of the bad matchups for Rogue, because you just get burned out a lot. I just want to experience for the next 50 minutes my opponent not drawing a single piece of early game and getting every single answer to every single thing my opponent's going to play. Because that'll even out my night so far. Just 50 minutes straight of that. There we go. So far, so good. I don't know if that's really a trash play. It might just be absolutely horrible draws from him. My eyes are open. <sighs> Why do mages draft at least three explosive runes? Because that's what Blizzard gives them. Hmm. Right now, 80% of shamans have 1.5 lightning storms. Not exactly drafting when you're given the same cards just about every time. Same goes for explosive runes. Explosive runes are the second most common mage card at about 60% of decks. Um, but like when I play mage, I don't even pick explosive runes. Because people know to play around it. So. Yeah, I don't know about this. Flame Strike is pretty unlikely card right now. I actually looked it up today. It's zero zero. The correct play is to trade, assuming it's vaporize. Yeah, I looked it up today. Flame Strike is the twelfth most common mage card. It's actually very uncommon. I want to see Giant. Engaging TC-130, mental dislocator! Justice is mine! Yep, they praise. God, I played so fucking well. Yes, praise me. Give praise. Thank you. You look very familiar. Please clap. Exactly. Exactly. Damn, sick coin. Alright, so for real, this guy played horribly and he's gonna lose. Alright, All right, good. I'm glad we're on the same page. new to the game. Well, the last time you could get that card back was in December, so he's not that new. It's a shaman. Should be relatively easy, I'd say. Rogues have lots of answers against shaman. 
course. Go ahead. No, I, yeah, yeah. Always, I, yeah, yeah. What do you mean? Not a lot of things do five. to make that trade, mostly because of the flame tongue totem. I don't see why I should waste five good damage here. Especially with a sea giant in hand. Maybe without the sea giant I might trade. But right now I want minions on the board. One minion should be a very small risk. That is quite possibly the worst card to play in this spot, let alone coin it out. I'm so confused right now. I want to play around MC Tech, but I also want to play around Volcano. And with Volcano, 3 health means Big Minion gets to stay alive. What? This is Coin Volcano or something? Yeah, it's Coin Volcano. Oh, no, it's just far away. Okay. Well, maybe he didn't have another play, so maybe it's fine. So. Doesn't look doesn't look that fine to me, but that's okay. Neither snow nor rain nor witch. He was sitting on Hex and coined the Kodo. Wow. I mean, you know, I know I get the bad rap sometimes for like trash talking some people, but like, come on, come on, guys, come on. That guy that was saying that I always trash talk the players that I beat and I'm so great and stuff. What do you want me to say? He coined a Kodo instead of hexing an 8-8. He had a lightning storm somehow. Somehow. He had a, we just found that out. Oh, but it's okay. Because he got really lucky and double rolled three. And now he saved himself from lethal. Oh, and lightning bolt after. Nice. I hope you like my invention. There once was a man from Gilnea. Whatever. Justice is mine. This plays make zero sense. Yes. Pay attention, class. I am here to learn. I am here to learn. Kim. And will Crip's juicy butthole get the attention they deserve now? It's true. Mind if I roll need? <sighs> okay. Justice is mine. Mm. It's really scary. I don't like the patient assassin though. Or one that's a pretty common follow up to frothing. Fine. <laughs> 
is pretty dangerous. Rotten to my core. Go ahead. Make my day. Just hope there's no MC tech. There might be a warpath set up as well. In any case, we'll find out right about now. Defend the gates. It's a pretty good draw. Is for a new class. Yeah, that's never happening anymore. Shit. I don't need any of you. Ash to ash. I don't think that guy's gonna last anyway, so it's alright. I'm so insanely behind from him going first with a ridiculous opener that there's almost no amount of top decks that are going to recover this game for me. Gorehal is very much a win more card. You're winning the whole game and haven't taken any damage. You get like a 6 to 7 in 1 removal. If you have been losing and are low on health, you get Fireball. that what would I draw? It isn't that much. Hey, lights out. I really hate win more cards. Hearthstone has always had the problem of the early game being a landslide going to one player who gets a luckier opening hand. And because they've never managed to fix that, I do think win more cards in the first like four to five turns are hilariously bad for the game. It's like, hey look! It's like, remember Pirate Warrior? Hey look! I drew double one drop pirate and got patches. Guess you're fucked. And then it's just downhill from there, right? Didn't draw that? Well, it's over. Oh, nowadays you have Keliseth, sorry. Yeah. Think about the skill in drawing Keliseth. There's a lot there, right? There's a lot. So, yeah. They kind of fixed it by ensuring quests were in your opener. But, but the quests suck. A lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Yeah, I'm doing okay until Warpath comes to town, but if I'm lucky, that's not going to be for a while. 
Skill drawing barns on turn four. Now you're speaking my language here. It's exactly the kind of skill I'm referring to. Precisely. See that? That's skill. 14 cards in the deck. Put that in the deck. When I have some chance, immediately draws it. As if he needed more luck on his side. Nice. <gasps> now that's skill, boys. That's some skill right there. Alright. Uh, in all seriousness, I am not prepared to take one more damage here. Justice is mine. Do I want to trade? No, I think I'm good. So, what you got? How do you eliminate RNG in a card game? You don't have to eliminate it. You just have to stop making cards with RNG effects. Because the nature of the game is RNG already. Oh my god, I'm, I'm gonna win here. I can't fucking believe that. I like it. Tired of the random arena deck bullshit. Well, the way I see it is, in arena, you have a pretty good chance to have a fun time. In constructed, you know the odds up front, but the odds are a lot worse. And in some metas, the odds are zero. I don't need any of you. Like we just talked about Pirate Warrior and stuff. You know the odds of having fun against Pirate Warrior? Is mine. When half the ladder is playing Pirate Warrior? You know the odds of that? You should. Because it's really low. Smelly fish. Yummy fish. As long as there's no Dragon Slayer, I'm good here. I'll put it on your head. Goodbye. I hope you like my invention. Yeah, I think that's good here. I don't need any of you. Oh, if you're sure. Oh, if you're sure. Shadow Man is pretty good. Otherwise, no. I should have gone for the face hit 100% there, that's my bad. against the priest, I think I will keep some card draw. Is someone injured? Could have swung at him. May have been alright. Yeah, if he kills that, I get to combo SI or Perdition's Blade, which is pretty nice. Don't think 
that's worth it. He knows now, he knows. Another card, but that's not a big deal. Not really. I can do. That's four. That's two. Hmm, Six plus eight. I wonder. That'll do it, I guess. Yeah, that'll do it. Justice is mine. Good thing I made that attack last turn. Otherwise, this would have sucked quite a lot. side there. Seems like a horrible card to play right now. But let's find out. Patient assassin needs a big board clear, or it's over of some kind at least. Or, yeah, it's over. Damn, I have lethal now. Play the taunt there because mind control will still make him lose. So it's not a big deal if we get mind controlled. Oh, it just has death. Right? Go ahead. There once was a man from Gilneas. Justice is mine. Okay. Killing it with Rogue this week. Yeah, Rogue's really good. Okay. Explains why you can't win with Rogue. The light protects me. 
Warlock's really good, though. Justice is mine. I don't know how well this is gonna work out, but... See? Oh, excuse me. Justice is mine. I don't really want to play the Harding Dragon, but if I play the Kobo Illusionist, then get the Harding Dragon, that's like a million times worse. Guess that means we're playing the Harding Dragon. That's pretty good. Favorite class and I play WoW, not even close. Hunter. Some Death Knight builds are alright, but the light nothing else me. came close. Um, one thing I'm trying to do is isolate the Bone Drake with the Cobalt Illusionist. Uh, doing that uh, lets me get a bonus random dragon, and as we've seen recently, these random dragons can be very, very good. So many possibilities. Well, he needs an answer and a taunt won't work, so he's in some trouble. He can absolutely get out of trouble. Let's see if he can. One shot, one hit. Control tech certainly a possibility. Most likely he'll just play like a taunt or two, and that might actually work. Not, uh, not one yet. Probably not, at least. Oh boy. Warlock upgrade. None can escape my fury. I'm doing okay, pretty sleepy today, but uh alright. I'll manage. Poison blade. Oh, we'll see. Maybe not. Do you like to play with fire? Uh oh. Um. Justice is mine. Not crazy happy about this play, but it's all right. Destroy. Yeah, just think Assassinate's a good card in general. Neither snow nor rain, no witch. 
Computing. Is that the thinking? Nice little touch. What fools these mortals be! Okay. Computing. Uh, let's see, Jan, I'm gonna need you to do some serious work. Let's start some trouble. Yep. Assassinate's more face damage, but nah, let's do this. Justice is mine. <laughs> Not bad. You brought me back. Over. I'm sure I have a couple of V necks, but yeah, I don't I don't really wear them a whole lot. I like wheat beers. Vice beer. Go ahead. Try one of them. You haven't yet. Fake beer. Nothing fake about it. quite good, but he still stays rather behind on the board, so it's not like game breaking good. Who's gonna win the Overwatch League? <laughs> if you can find someone who watches the whole thing and lets me know, you can let me know. Yeah, this one we lose. Four poisonous hits. Mm. I think I'll pass. Justice is mine. It is interesting, but no thanks. Overwatch League is 80 to 90 k views. You were shocked. That's okay. Next expansion will come out. We'll open some packs and hopefully beat that. Chum's boss. Ooze. Yeah, Ooze is actually pretty rare. Shouldn't ever play around it. Out of my jungle. That's rather nice. Justice is mine. Pretty slow crushing MC Tech if it lands. Peak your ship 77k last expansion. Okay. Let's go. Ha, this guy's toast. Justice is mine. Needs pain or shadow madness. Hopefully he's got neither. Fuck. Let me 
go home! Hey, like that. Justice is mine. MC it, bro. MC it. You know you want it. Get that MC. Fuck. play that it's pretty bad if he does actually have MC Only mind blast. No, there's no mind blast on Arena, man. Winner. Play this fire recently. Why is mage bad? Mage doesn't fight for the board. Yeah, direct damage is what makes mage really dangerous. Engaging TC-130, mental dislocator! Justice is mine! The good thing is, on 5 mana, the only reasonable answer here is going to be a polymorph or a dragon slayer. Weasler. Donald Trog, oh. Yes. Justice is mine. I gotta try to push some damage every turn now so I don't get pinged out. My duty is to the king! Put 
Yeah, Bundrake was good, and the Charger was good, and that was not good. This guy's Dead in two turns. Well, yeah, you have to do that, though. Um... So if you leave a 4-1 up and he has some kind of removal like a polymorph, that 4 damage guy might hit you in the face at least twice, and in that case you lose to a large number of other cards. Optional weapon hit, I'd say. Damn, I could have really used those. He actually has to play a bunch of cards or I might mill him with the coins. It's hilarious. No class restriction in arena or brawl. That just up the crazy, man. No, I don't want to up the crazy in arena. I want to lower the crazy in arena. I must consider... Draw your play more draw what are you doing? Okay. For me. All right, all right. Don't unfollow. I got gotcha. you. Not, but we haven't seen it in a while. 
Oh, this is gonna go to shit. Yeah. Uh, wonderful. Downside is coin primordial Drake. Holy Nova is not too bad. How long can this go on? How long can this go on? It's I think I should have milled. I suppose, given what I ended up drawing. So much stealing. Take that. Using death to deal one damage. Okay. I'm happy with that too, actually. Not ecstatic, but happy enough. Is someone injured? It still has another death. We have to be wary of that. Really, the answer here. Desperate seas I roam. You have been. We're like going second now. Uh, that's kind of crappy. Now 
Neither snow nor rain nor wind. For me! Justice is mine. Done the waste that. It's fine. Golem. Okay. Move. I cast arcane missiles. Okay. Such hacks, I know. Yeah, just leave this weapon up here, no big deal. Okay. Seems like all my rogue decks do great lately. Yep. Seems like. Yeah, I played Brawl like two days ago like that. The day we got Brawl is when I played Brawl. I might have to play MC Tech on Curve. Oh, thank God. Okay. I don't need justice is mine. He's gonna coin the hex. Oh no. That's fine. For me. Neither snow nor rain nor witch. Oh, that's really bad. Benefits from experience, mm. maybe. Out of my jungle. Are serious? X is really common, but it doesn't mean he has one right now, so... I sense your struggle. I believe it's time to play around MC Tech. Please proceed to sacrifice your 1-1 one, one and not totem. Thank you. I'm just helping him out here. Oh. Okay. Ooh, that's a sweet one. Ha, this guy's toast. Wait, actually, when it comes down to a volcano, I want my 1-4 as healthy as possible. Okay, that's fine. I'll just eat it with the ear out of the face. Oh. <laughs> 
zero three to twelve zero. This is honestly an unremarkable rogue deck. Sixty-eight point rogue deck. It's got like two epic cards and nothing special. Okay. Nice. Now, I haven't opened packs for a while, but I think I think in this case we can make a small exception. We can open two packs. 